Good morning. Today we're here at Aldi. We're going to go and check out some of the prices, some of the things you guys have asked about. Check the shelves. Look around, see if we can find any holiday items, maybe some Aldi saver deals. Let's get to it. Okay, as soon as we come into Aldi here, been a lot of talk on saltine crackers lately. I'll be honest with you, this is probably one of my favorites. $1.49. Uh, they're pretty close to the great value. Now, great value is $1.74 now for their box. So a little cheaper here on the Savers brand at Aldi. Um, I'm not a huge fan of oyster crackers, but we've been getting a lot of comments on them. Some people are saying you haven't been able to find them at our Aldi. They were not at our Aldi for the longest time. They, they came back in, but they came back in at a much higher price, $1.35. What is one of my favorites anyway is this Shoker chocolate here with almonds. Guys, these, this is fantastic. $1.39, guilty pleasure of mine. I uh, bought a couple of these the last time I was here. $1.49 is the regular price. But this is one of their cheaper ones, and I, I think it's the best. I do like some of the ones that are like packaged like separately, stay fresh a little longer. $2.49 for those, though. Oh, I noticed they got some of their dried fruits back in here. We get a lot of comments on these. They have the dried cranberries here. This is all by Southern Grove. Dried cranberries, $1.95 for these. Probably the cheapest one right here. Yeah, the blueberries and mixed berries are $2.79. But that's an, on an Aldi Saver deal down from $2.99. The dried apricots, $2.95 on sale. And the dried mangoes, $3.99 on sale down from $4.19. Well, for whatever reason, raisins went up again. These were $349, went up to $379, $409. These were $299 last year. Yeah, we've got some freeze-dried Fuji apples and some freeze-dried strawberries right here. $349. These pack up well, guys. These have a long expiration date or best if used by date. Probably last way past that anyway, but good thing to have in your preps. Stock up on also got the banana chips here for $3.19. They do have some of their Winking Owl wine back in. I know a lot of people who like these. They did go up a dollar, $4.95. They used to be $3.99, but at least they're getting them back in, I guess. We've been getting comments of a lot of spices being missing in a lot of different stores. We deal with that ourselves. We saw where it was, a lot was missing at Walmart and Kroger. One of the Krogers I went to, one was pretty well stocked, but... I want to point out some of these, still 99 cents for a lot of these ones here at Aldi. Um, and I don't think we've really ever had any bad comments on any of these spices. So I know some of our viewers like the organic Simply Nature ones. These are actually on a little bit of a deal, 10 cent savings, 229 on the Aldi Saver deals. Got the ground cumin, ground cinnamon, crushed red pepper, ground turmeric. I notice they have an Aldi Saver deal on their cooking oil. The Carlini cooking oil, $3.49. That is down from $3.65. They have taken the price down for the canola oil. I would assume it's the same price. I don't know, though. They don't have the price there. Five-pound bag of flour, still $2.19. And sugar, $3.09 for a four-pound bag. So a little cheaper than everywhere else right now. As much as this is weird for me to say, the two pound bags of Baker's Choice sugar here is more than Kroger right now. $2.15 regular price. Regular price at Kroger is $2.49, but they have theirs on sale for $1.79 a bag. So uh, we've been hearing that some Aldi prices will be dropping for the holidays, but that won't be till no I think November 1st, Walmart and Aldi. So we'll be back to check out some more of those deals, but just wanted to see, make sure they're getting in some of these products. They do have the Baker's Choice Evaporated Milk here, $1.19 here, $1.39 regular price for the Kroger brand. They do have the Baker's Choice 100% Pure Pumpkin, uh, $1.39. I believe that's the same price as Great Value. Uh, a lot of the prices between Walmart and Aldi are now the same. We notice that with a lot of their different things. Uh, they do have the pumpkin pie mix here, the big can for $2.69. Uh, what's this? Baker's Choice fried apple with cinnamon. That sounds good. $1.69 for that. They've got some of their different pie fillings here. Pie fillings have been skyrocketing in price at grocery stores lately. So these aren't too bad. They got the apple here, $1.99, $2.19 for the cherry on sale down from $2.39. They have the sweetened condensed milk here by Baker's Choice for $1.75. That's down from $1.85. I hope these aren't the decreases. I, I hope they're a little better than that when they come in. 
because if it's just a 10 cent decrease on these that's not much of a savings they do have the nestle carnation here evaporated milk dollar 72 and then a lot of people were saying just go with the store brands it's the same exact thing um not really too sure but a lot of people on the channel say that dollar 72 for the nestle there uh actually dollar 67 at kroger right now so a few pennies cheaper there i do have to say these baker choice or baker's corner sorry baker's corner 98 cents for the yellow cake and the white cake these are uh, pretty good, and for the price, you can't really beat it. I got the Devil's Food Cake Mix right here, 98 cents. It's a good deal. Looks like they got their double chocolate brownie mix back in by Specially Selected. $1.95 for that. They've got some of the chewy fudge. Uh, Baker's Choice down here. I always say Baker's Choice. Baker's Corner, $1.19 for that. One of our longtime viewers was asking about the price of the grapeseed oil at Aldi. It is $4.49. I know you said you've been having trouble finding it. Uh, this sells out pretty quickly at Aldi, so maybe just wait till they come back in. I know it used to be $3.99. It did go up a while back. They do have the 100% avocado oil, which we get comments on all the time by Simply Nature. $5.79 down from $6.19 this week. So the last time I was here at Aldi, they were completely wiped out of their heart-to-tail cat food, the dry cat food. Uh, we did see where it went up in price, $6.99 a little while ago. This has gone like double in price in the last year and a half. Um, and the canned cat food has gone up a little bit too. Uh, still the same as it's been for a couple months though, $0.59 cents a can for either uh, this one here or the smaller cans. And again, I will point out, we always get viewers on the channel that always talk about these heart-to-tail packets. Uh, I know people always compare them to the Caesar packets that they sell at other grocery stores, but you're paying like half the price, 79 cents a piece. These did go up four cents a little while, a few weeks ago, but still two of these for the price of one of the Caesar packets. So we've been getting comments from a lot of our viewers out east, a couple viewers up near Boston, Philadelphia, um, saying that your Aldi's have been a little low on paper products. So I definitely wanted to check this out Looks like ours is pretty full. There are actually some okay deals too. This big pack here, $18.99, this had gone up to $20.99 at one point, but it's since come back down. They got the Ultra here, $9.49 on an Aldi Saver deal. That's down from $9.99. Then they have the smaller packs of the Willow So Soft here for $5.19. And then the one we always compare to the like regular grocery stores here, $11.09 for the 18 mega rolls on an Aldi Saver deal. That's a great deal, down from $13.99. Now as to where all paper plates have gone up over the last year, I mean, it's good to see they're getting them in. Uh, these are the ones we usually get, the Boulder Ultra 50 plates for $5.79. That's a really good deal. They got the cheapos here, which you get 70 plates for $3.09, but they're, the, they're like the flimsy ones. Uh, these are really good here and an okay price these days. Somebody asked me the other day if Aldi carried any over-the-counter medicines. They have a select few. They have a thing of acetaminophen here and ibuprofen. These are 100 count, I believe. Yeah, 100 counts on both. And that is the West, the Welby. By Welby, they have the uh, basically the Flonase spray, Fluticasone. They have some different allergy relief. Omeprazole, right? Take care of that heartburn. They got a, they have fish oil vitamins. Yeah, they got a couple different vitamin gummies and stuff like that. But yeah, not not very much. But they do have some. I remember also in your comment you were asking about hand sanitizer. They do sell hand sanitizer. It's a small thing for a dollar sixty nine, and I did just look at this too, because hand sanitizer hand sanitizer is really only good if it's seventy percent alcohol. This is 62%. So it's not going to completely, it says kills 99% germs, but you need 70% to be able to do that. So I don't know. I don't know if that's worth it. I mean, for the same price at Walmart, you can get one that's probably a little cheaper and 70%. Checking out some of the produce here. Got the 10 pound bag of potatoes, russet potatoes here for $5.49. It's the best deal anywhere. Of course, Meyer has theirs right now for $5.99 on sale. So if you don't have an Aldi and you got Meyer, got a couple days to get that deal. We do have their 
dull celery here. Big, huge stalks of celery here. Just kind of look through them, make sure you get a good batch of them. $1.69, it's the cheapest around. We have been seeing celery anywhere between $1.79 and $1.99 anywhere else. They got some of their different squashes here, all 89 cents a pound, regular price. Somebody was asking about ginger root the other day, and I haven't been able to find any. Found some here. Looks good, too. $1.99 for a batch. It says it's 8 ounces, but some of them look bigger than others. And we've been getting more and more comments on different garlic. Uh, also, they have the little three packs here. That's where I usually get them. $1.15. $1.15 for those. Uh, it's anywhere from for $0.69 cents to $0.79, cents, pretty much everywhere I go for one, one garlic, piece of garlic. So, yeah, $1.15. Yeah, you know, it's a good deal. Three-pack peppers here at Aldi, still $2.69. That's a great deal, less than a dollar a pepper. Do like we do, cut them up and freeze them, you know. I mean, all grocery stores, they're like $1.49 to $1.59 a piece, you know, unless you find them on sale, and it's never that good. Uh, cabbage here, we got a couple comments on cabbage. I gotta say, this cabbage looks pretty good. It is 75 cents a pound though. One of our longtime viewers on the channel was saying she was canning some tomatoes, getting up some tomatoes. It's a good idea because they are starting to look not as good. Uh, $1.19 a pound for the Roman tomatoes. They also have the sunset, uh, sun dried tomatoes here. Um, or no, I'm sorry, the tomatoes on the vine here, $2.89. But that's per package, not per pound. And we got some okay Aldi Saver deals right here. We got the three pack candy apples, caramel apples here, $2.49. Yeah, it's higher than what they were last year. They were $1.99. But we've been seeing these for like anywhere between $3.99 and $5.99 everywhere else. They have the shrubs, tomatoes here that we just saw at Kroger for $3 on sale. $1.99 here at Aldi. $1.29 for sliced mushrooms. Look at this. Yes, that is going in the cart. Wow, that's a good price, $1.29. And we got blackberries here, the six ounce packs for $1.89. Not the best sale we've seen at Aldi. As a matter of fact, the last time we saw these on sale, they were $1.49. But everything's going up. Uh-oh, somebody sounds hungry. Uh, they have the, or oh boy. Uh, they have the organic honey gold bite-sized potatoes here for $2.99 on the Aldi Saver deal. Yeah, we saw the Sweet Tango Apples at Kroger for $1.47 a pound on sale. Here at Aldi, $1.19 a pound on sale. These are great apples. Delicious. Mangoes here at Aldi are $1.09. Now, they were $0.95, cents, but I saw them go up to $1.50 at Kroger. And they have the Del Monte Limes here, $2.39 a pound. $2.39 a pound, so not much of a savings. They used to be $1.99. $1.49 on sale for the Ocean Spray. One pound package here, $1.49, that's a good deal. We saw a two pound thing at Kroger for $3.99. Look at this, got pomegranates here, $1.89. I see these between $3.50 and $4 for one at some other store, so that's not too bad of a price. Cantaloupes here are $2.79 still. Now we know they were $2.49 not long ago, but we just saw them go back up to $3.29 at Kroger and some other stores, so $2.79, it's an okay price. And I'll tell you what, in my own opinion, Aldi has some of the best apples. I like Trader Joe's Gala apples, but Aldi is quick second best. Um, I love their apples. I'm actually getting some of those sweet tango apples. <laughs> Too good of a deal to pass up. $1.19 a pound. They look awesome and delicious. And speaking of delicious, red delicious apples have also come down here at Aldi. They were $3.29 a pound. Now, regular price, $2.99 a pound. These are my mom's favorite. They have these big, huge honey crisp apples here for $1.89 a pound. I like the smaller ones, and it's $3.29 for two pounds. That's a great deal. And they taste, I love the smaller ones, I always think taste better. They got the pink lady here for $3.59, but look at this $2.89 for the Granny Smith. How did this happen? This came down like almost a dollar. These have got way high in price, so maybe they, maybe they weren't selling them. So I don't know if I mentioned this the last time I was here, but the three pound bags of uh, onions here, yellow onions, came back down to 219. These did go up to 249, 219 again now. $1.89 for two pounds of red onions here. That is like 70 cents cheaper than Walmart. Five pound bags of red and yellow potatoes, 
$3.49. And they have the large baking potatoes for three pounds. No, I'm sorry, five pounds, $3.49. So we got another comment on distilled white vinegar. Someone said they were having trouble finding it. Um, we haven't had much of an issue in the last month. We did see it start to disappear at the beginning of fall, mostly because it's like canning season, I believe, but still $3.29 on the gallon size here at Aldi. Um, it's like $3.80 everywhere else. And I noticed it was $2.95, but they also have these smaller ones here. Dollar twenty-five. Those were ninety-five cents. So, yep, more things going up here at Aldi. Okay, so uh, I do have some sad news. It looks like Tuscan Garden went up again here. Now, I gotta be honest with you. I do like this better than the Olive Garden. This is good stuff right here. Two nineteen. It's only up from a dollar ninety-nine. This was a dollar forty-nine last year, and I remember everybody was losing it when it went from a dollar forty-nine to a dollar seventy-nine. My wife included. She loves this. Uh, notice the oil and vinegar of these went up to these used to be two 229 up to 249 but these have always been a little more pricey okay so i'm going to be honest with you guys do not pay 429 at kroger for a jug of mott's apple juice when you can get this i love apple juice i love mott's but i will never pay four dollars and 29 cents that is absolutely ridiculous i'll get it if it's on sale for like 299 i think it's on sale this week dollar 89 though for this this is good stuff. I, I think it tastes as good or better than Mott's, in my opinion. Oh, well, they've got their specially selected 100% juices back in here. They got the black cherry, one I know everybody likes, and they got the cranberry one. Never tried this one, but the black cherry one is awesome. They also have the superfood 100% juice by Simply Nature. This is the organic, 379. You know why there's only one in here? Because it's awesome. Not going to go over all of these this week. We did go over all of these the last time we were here, but I just want to point out they got the Brookdale Chunk Chicken Breast here, two ninety five, twelve and a half ounce can, two ninety five on sale, down from three fifteen, which is already an okay deal. Then they got the big cans of the Hormel Corned Beef Hash, who hash? <laughs> oh, it's getting close to the holidays. Uh, five nineteen for that, down from five thirty four, so a little bit of a deal. And the corned beef here, which I believe is better than Libby's in my opinion. Look at this, two forty nine, two forty nine. That came down again. It was two ninety nine, now two forty nine. Awesome. Okay, so the last time or two we came to Aldi, the canned vegetables were a lot lower than normal. The Happy Harvest, still sixty four cents. Some of them a little more. These peas, though, I love these. I know I say this every time we come here, but these are fantastic. 95 cents for those. But, um, yeah, they definitely have in a lot more. But we've been getting comments from, from some of the same viewers out east that shop at Aldi saying that a lot of their Happy Harvest canned vegetables and stuff have been low or out. So we need to pay attention. Specially selected charcuterie shop. Yes, please. Uh, they got the red pepper fruit spread here. Somebody was saying that was really good. That is $2.99 for that. And the sour cherry. Ooh, and here's this, uh, here's this Akia. Uh, Akia. <laughs> uh, Akasia. Akasia honey here. Got some good comments on that. I cannot pronounce that to save my life. Uh, the honey with the honeycomb in it, $7.49 for this. We got a lot of good comments on this like a couple years ago. Uh, when they were flying off the shelves and i i hadn't seen these in the longest time finally started seeing them come back in still 749 so it's, it's a little pricey but people swear by it we got some of the different crackers down here artisan crackers three dollars and 49 cents for those some of the different boxed wheat crackers there scalloped crackers dollar 99 then they have the cheese crisp three dollars and 49 cents they got the Mission Figs here, the dried figs. I know my mom loves these. $2.39. That is a good deal. That's a good deal. Figs, figs and <laughs> that size bag usually are like five bucks or more. Uh, I will say something I was not a fan of. These different specially selected olives. I don't know. They just, I had the, uh, I think it was the feta cheese. Or no, it was blue cheese. Blue cheese. I, I tried the jalapeno also though wasn't a big fan um i mean i do love stuffed olives but these just these didn't do it for me they do have the different uh premium mustard assorted varieties here 2.99 for those and then they have the specially selected different roasted red pepper artichoke 2.49 for these 
pretty awesome. Nice when they have it all laid out here for you. I came in here wanting to buy one thing, and I've, I'm already up to like 10 items, but that's okay. We're saving money here. $3.74 for the Nutella. Um, pretty close to what the price is everywhere. We had somebody asking about Nutella. I know it's been a couple weeks. I try to get to the comments as quick as I can, but sometimes, you know, just wanted to point this out. I remembered you, though. Okay, now, these are the smaller ones. $3.74. You know, the best deals, um, either Walmart or Meyer, but these are anywhere from $3.99 to $4.29. I think $4.29 for the small one at Kroger. It's been a while since I've checked on them. Uh, they got the Live G Free here. Different stroganoff and kind of like, uh, like Hamburger Helper, but gluten-free version. To give you an idea also, they have the Olive Garden Italian dressing, $4.18 for 16 ounces. So, this one is a way better deal. I also noticed right next to here, they have Olive Garden's famous croutons. I'll tell you, I haven't seen these in so long. These are Jessica's favorite croutons. They are a little pricey, $2. $2 for these, but you know what? Happy wife, happy life. So, I don't know if prices have come down yet, or not at Aldi. This is the first time I've seen the Butterball turkeys here at Aldi in a while. $1.59 a pound though, way better than Meyer, $2.99 a pound. We haven't even seen any at Kroger. $1.59 a pound. Hopefully it gets cheaper than that. Don't know if they're, they got this right here. 16 to 22 pound whole turkey intermain coat. So I don't know if they're getting ready to on the first. We'll have to come back here in a week or so and check out some of the sale prices they have. We did get a comment that one of your Aldi was out of spaghetti completely. You said it was completely wiped out. This happened to us and at our store a couple months ago. I will say it came back and it's at the same prices that it was when it left. So I don't know if they were just struggling with it for a while. So hopefully it starts to come back because our Aldi over the last few weeks has gotten in a lot more different variety as well. So they also got the two pound boxes here for $1.88, making them less than a dollar a pound. Okay, well, a lot of people on the channel know my love for crab, and some people were saying that the crab cakes at Aldi, the frozen ones, are some of the best you've ever had. There's five crab cakes here. $4.99 on an Aldi finds deal. Don't know when I'll ever see this. First time I've ever seen this at our Aldi, so I'm going to give it a shot. Checking out some of the different frozen fruits here. i got to say they are a lot lower than normal. We've been getting comments that Aldi's been very low on their frozen fruits lately. Um, you know, they don't carry, like, a ton like Walmart does. But, yeah, some of these prices have gone up. Um, but they do got in their berry medley here. They got the strawberries here. $3.29, $7.49 for the berry medley. That is two pounds. They've got the blueberries up here we always get the comments on. $4.39, I know that was $3.99 last year. 24 ounces. And, and remember... Not maybe about a year and a half ago, they were 340. I remember when they went up from 299 to 349. Now 439. So I don't know. They do have the Simply Nature Organic strawberries as well. 549 for those. So they don't have much ice cream here at Aldi, but I gotta say it is a good price, and we always get great comments on it. I know we get good comments on the cookies and cream. Uh, somebody was mentioning the vanilla was really good. Got the specially selected vanilla here. It's a little pricey at $5.99. But yeah, I've heard both these are really good. Let me know down in the comments if you've tried them, which one you like better. Oh, they got the mint chocolate chip also. $2.49. So somebody asked about this a while ago. Like, it's been months. I haven't seen it at our Aldi. I know people were asking. Uh, I know you really love this. They do have it. The Barissimo Cappuccino. They got the caramel and the French vanilla. It's the one you asked about. Good to see they're coming. Maybe this is a seasonal thing. $4.19 for that. Oh boy, looks like we got the Christmas stuff here. We got lit up Christmas tree Santa. That is cool. It's nice. Yeah, little tree lights up there. No price on it. I don't know. Oh, three ninety nine for these. That's pretty cool. Oh, look at that. Got the red truck here. Is that three ninety nine too? I might buy that. Getting close. A couple months. Oh, that is too cool. Yeah, I'm buying that. Well, look at this here. Here is a two-foot LED tabletop tree here, $8.99. That is really cool. I feel like, oh, they got a silver one here too. Uh-oh, boy. 
if Jessica watches this video, we'll probably be making another trip to Aldi here. <laughs> they don't have a lot out yet, but they are starting to put them out. We have a tree kind of like this. 20 bucks. Well, I think I paid like 30 for mine. Let's see. Does it all light up here? Oh, yeah. Oh, nope, just the star. Check out these little reefs right here. This is pretty cool. Really nice. I like this one here. $6.99. I like the price, too. These bows right here. $2.99. You can buy the wreath. Get the bow. Put it on there if you like. Well, I don't know if you do that, but look at this, too. You got these big, huge, like, baskets. $9.99 for those. Hold on. I don't feel like some of these prices are too bad. They got these nostalgic village houses here. $9.99. I guess they light up on the inside. Oh, yeah. Well, that was our trip to Aldi today. Found some good deals. I picked up a lot of stuff. I didn't think I was going to do as much shopping today. I got those sliced mushrooms. Looked fresh. Looked like they were just cut. Make that with dinner and something tonight. Got the crab cakes. I'm excited to try those. Got a lot of good comments from you guys on those. Uh, got the croutons for Jess. Uh, got the little red truck that lights up with the tree in the back for Christmas. $3.99 for that. I thought that was a pretty good deal. Um, I always like looking through the Aldi finds and the here today, gone tomorrow aisles and stuff like that. Uh, always good to see. I like how they they do a good job at displaying things here at this Aldi. Like all of the specially selected different fruit spreads with the honey and the crackers and all that stuff. I really like how they do that here. A lot of that stuff is a little pricey, but they are good quality items. Anything I've ever had from specially selected other than those olives have always been pretty good. But guys, thank you so much for joining me today. Always good deals here at Aldi. Uh, we'll have to check here in a week or so uh, when the first rolls around. They're supposed to lower a lot of the different holiday items. Uh, but yeah, some of those 10 cent decreases, I have a feeling it's gonna be a lot more than that. So stay tuned. We will be going, coming back here, uh, here in the near future. So guys, thank you so much for watching. With all that being said, I am out. And always remember the adventure is out.